So here we are going to start the PPT about some case study on intellectual property rights. So before going into the detail, first of all, uh, we will discuss some basic information like what are the tangible and what are intangible properties. Okay, tangible properties are those properties which can we can touch, uh, we can physically see them like gold, car, house. This we know how to protect these things. Uh, we know that how to protect the gold, how to protect the car, house, or any valuable items that are present. That are present. We know that things, but those. Uh, there are some other uh, items like intangible which are the creation of mind which are creas created by the intellectual uh, mind of the human beings then the question arises how can we protect them if we invent something new how to protect them so that no any other person can copy that if we write a book if we write a uh, poem or song how can we protect them so that no any other person can copy that and for that we have intellectual property right because all these things come under intellectual property which are created by the intellect of the human being examples are inventions literary and artistic work design symbols so to take that we have intellectual property that uh, what uh, what is the intellectual property that we have discussed intellectual property refers to the creation of the mind such as invention literary artistic work design symbols so these are all the intellectual property okay what are intellectual property rights those rights which are uh, given to us by the government of india or government of any other country to protect the intellectual property are called intellectual property rights uh, we have total six Six intellectual property rights. One is patent, design, trademark, geographical education, copyright, semiconductor, integrated circuit layer. We will discuss in very brief uh, uh, what intellectual property comes under invention. Uh, what uh, what in intellectual property comes under patent? These are the invention. Means those things which uh, which can bring scientific development. Okay, are uh, called invention and they can be protected by patent. It can be product or it can be process. If there is any uh, there is any process which can bring any technological advance. Okay. Like uh, uh, or any product like we are using mobile with with two camera. Now some any company come with a, a mobile with three camera. It bring a technological advancement in the camera. So it is called invention. And how can we protect them? We can protect them by the patent design. Any shape configuration. We see the different designs cloth like sari, jeans, t-shirt. How can how the company protect them by the design right? Or trademark. We see the uh, the name of different company like the Apple, HP, Dell, Samsung. The symbols symbols like the nike symbol the tick mark okay the mcdonald symbol the style of writing m how this company will protect these symbols or name they are protected by the trademark right geographical education any product which is famous from any particular place like we know that uh bangal Sugula or odisha Sugula or darjeeling tea so we see that this product come with a particular name particular place name so they are protected by geographical indication so if any person sitting in Tamil Nadu want to sell a tea uh, tea that have origin from the Darjeeling, they have to specifically uh, name the tea as a Darjeeling tea so that that person will not claim tea seed. These tea leaves come from Tamil Nadu because we all know that in Tamil Nadu or Kerala we have the tea plant. But if they are uh, using the tea leaves from Darjeeling, they have to specifically name tea, uh, tea as a Darjeeling tea. So this uh, protection of this uh, uh, particular product from a particular place come under geographical in the copyright. If any writer write a book or any singers uh, write a, a song uh, sing a song or any writer write a uh, song or any uh, anyone making a movie how can we protect them they co come under the copyright and the last one is a semiconductor integrator layout we all see that in inside inside the mobile or lab we have integrated circuit okay what are the what is the uh, what is the uh, full integrated circuit because shape of the integrated circuit decide the shape of that particular product we see we have the laptop with different size we have the 14 play laptop 15 26 display laptop 12 inch display Laptop. How? How? Because the shape of the circuit decides the shape of the product. So that, that also the integrated circuit design come under the uh, different uh, intellectual property right that is called semiconductor integrated circuit layer. So these are the basic of the different intellectual property. Right? So uh, IP uh, protect a small innovative firms like Bellex Aerospace, Dolby Laboratory. Uh, example. So we, we move into the another side, that is called patent. What is patent? A simple basic definition we need. What is patent? Patent hai kya? Patent is statutory right for an invention grant for a limited period of time to the patentee by the government in exchange of full disclosure of his invention for excluding others from making use uh, making using selling importing the product or process there are three important things patent who give the patent right the patent right given by the that particular government of that particular country in india it is given by the government of india first second is it given for the lifetime no it is given for the limited period of time uh, uh, what uh, what the inventor will disclose about that invention he has to everything to the government about 
force it can't hide anything and force it why this right is, uh, uh, why this right is uh, given so that no any other person can use that product or post can sell that product or process without taking permission of the of the inventor there are four important for the patent it is given by government india it is for the period of time it inventor has to disclose everything about the into the government here and it is protect that product or process for ethically patent is in a territorial and exclusive right okay if the government of india give in uh, the patent to, to the particular product or process to a uh, uh, inventor can some from different country like us or china can they copy that product or process yes they can copy that product or process because this right is given by the government of india so it protected only in, in the india then how can the inventor protect that uh, product or process so that no any other person in the whole world can put so that uh, for that we have to uh, put a process and that policy we don't different country india only we can uh, protect product or uh, thing for what is the term of the it is given only for the uh, with description of the patent these are some famous inventor and inventor like the phonographic inventor by the uh, edison telephone inventor by the graham bell telephone is inventor by the right brothers penicillin is inventor by the fleming like the fleming how can we know that this product process are uh, invented by that particular scientist how can we know that phone is invented by graham bell we know that because graham bell got patent for that product so if you invent something you don't go to the protocol of india protected product no we know that particular product invented by you. Uh, here we all need to michael jackson and if you uh, type in the youtube section the moon dance of the jackson michael jackson you will find that uh, this famous moon dance because everyone think that uh, it is a uh, edited version of the dance no it, is, it was not the edited version of the dance because obviously this poster dance is not possible uh, because of the so everyone everybody thinks that this is the edited version of the dance but it was not edited version of the dance there is creating anti gravity illusion this is the famous shoe by a particular person from the us and that shoe help in help in that type of dancing okay this is the application number discuss about the creating anti gravity illusion uh, by the michael jacks this is a famous shoe so we see that the importance of invention a particular invention bring the particular type uh, new type of dance okay the advantage of the invention the second case we all know the cricket okay so we find what is led stump since last 4 to 5 years we are seeing that led stump are being used in the cricket okay. we was getting uh, yes that is very simple invention but it is not a specific application number it is it's about a system indicating movement article from one position or orientation to another position or orientation see by the title of the invention we don't know it is discussing about the led stump okay because it is very generic term led stump is just an application of that application it was given a don't acronym uh, he is australian uh, okay so don't acronym he is he is the inventor and director at jing international jing international is a company which made which makes famous stump led stump the last in the bell help match cell met in the game over the digital bets help means like stump or run out what uh, what does this led stump do it helps accuracy because we all know that light travels faster than sound okay so when the ball hit light appears suddenly very instantly due to time gap accuracy this is the famous circuit diagram which help in designing the led stump when the ball hits the stump the bell float in float in the air and the light sensor ls19 gets all to light hence the light sensor react as flow switch and led this is the circuit appears that it is very simple circuit but it is not simple circuit why it is not a simple circuit we will discuss later okay uh, so this is the circuit of the cricket ball led flash sensor so how does it work what what the inventor gain from the inventor so, okay it is the simple one set of stuff uh, sorry uh, single stuff one set of stuff and uh, bell cost less 25 lakh that means so to be less 50 lakh per lakh because there are two set of being used in the market okay. so you see one set of uh, stuff and uh, we get cost five and so total 50 lakh are we ever put to see economy is a strict amount of that all the particular stuff are kept in that the economy for the enhance uh, inventor he He was stumped and the, the stump and the wicket in there. So every man a current got a lot of people see that. This is the advantage of invention. A current simply invented the LED stumps and the wicket. Okay, it is being used in the cricket match. A current simply see at the house get get in front. Now the man, then how much he got? He is getting simple that LED. So that is the advantage. By patent, you can rule over that means a current. Uh, if you invent something, you can't go to the market and sell the product. If you uh, a different uh, technology. 
information that is based on that information can't get patent in out. Every country has different rules and regulations. We all know that a patent is a territorial. So if you do any invention, it may happen that you can get a patent in US, you can get a patent in US, you can get a patent in Europe, but you can't get patent for that invention. In so in India, it can be used, it can be sale, so it can be uh, shared by anyone. But in US, that company has the got the right to use turmeric. In the US, different company can't use the turmeric without the permission of that company. But in India, you can't get uh, the patent for the turmeric. So any company, anyone can use uh, turmeric or haldi without getting permission. It is pretty true. Uh, one another uh, uh, case study that is known as AG versus Union of India. Okay, that is a very important uh, case in the history of patent in India because it changes the uh, the course of medicine in India. Uh, what happened there in India? Uh, okay, what happened in Novartis AG? In India? We all know that we got patent on the twenty. The judgment given by the Honorable Supreme Court prevent the ever greening of patented product and give relief to those who can't afford the life saving drug as these pharmaceutical companies sell such life saving drug at a very high price and unaffordable for the common. Uh, they turn ever greening patented product. We will discuss detail in the next uh, spot ever greening product. The Supreme Court's judgment made clear that India is a developing country and available medicine as it is necessary for the lives of the 1 billion people. Section 3 d of the Patent Act 1970 prevent by obtaining secondary patent by introducing minor change in existing technology from this pharmaceutical uh, company. Novartis failed to prove that therapeutical efficacy of beta crystalline form of imatinib is more as compared to the therapeutical efficacy of imatinib mesylate. Okay, so did application of Novartis for patent rejected by Supreme Court. We will discuss in detail. Uh, we all know that in the medicine are made by the chemical product. Every medicine is made, uh, made by the chemical product. Is that it has any chemical product? Okay, we all know that in chemical products by simply adding one gram of one liter, we can change the properties. Like if you are making the salt, NaCl, if we change this minor, we will bring change, it will change the, the taste, it will change the color, anything. That happened in the chemical product. Okay, so, so obviously if we change a simple, like if we add one uh, extra milliliter of any chemical, uh, uh, one milliliter of any extra uh, chemical, it will change the, the properties. And it is very easy to get patent for the chemical product. We can change the volume, we can change the uh, weight, and we bring the different chemical property and we can get the patent. It is very simple. So we have the section 3D. Section 3D says that no, by simply changing the volume, by simply changing the different property, you can't get the product. You can't get a patent. If you want to get the patent, that chemical product case and what is efficacy? Because the efficacy is some, uh, something change that we want. Like we see that in the case of uh, fever, okay, we get any medicine and our aim is that that medicine should reduce our fever from 1 to, uh, zero to 99. If that product bring that change, that is efficacy. Yes, that product bring efficacy. Okay. In the case of uh, medicine, the Supreme Court said that no, it will only bring case change of, uh, it will only bring the efficacy, it's bring the medical efficacy. Then what theoretical efficacy? Therapeutical efficacy, it means that it should bring some beneficial change. What does notice, uh, what does notice uh, did that? Like, yeah, uh, he got the patent for the imanitinib mesylate. It is some uh, uh, chemical product. Okay, imanitinib. After that, he bring this some other product that is called beta crystalline form of imanitinib mesylate. He must have changed somewhere. Uh, he must have changed uh, brings in the chemical property so that call the imatinibic mesylate and beta mesylate. The notice said, see, this is our product. Now I want patent for the product. Then said that, okay, your product is new, but your product has not bring any therapeutic efficacy. So what are the aim of the imatinibic mesylate? Same aim is, is being achieved by the, the new form that is called beta crystalline form of imatinibic mesylate. Okay, you use different products, you use the, some other uh, property of the product, but it has not bring any new uh, uh, therapeutic efficacy. So we, uh, you can't get a patent. What is patent evergreening? Evergreening practice we are like for attend a patent life of a drug by obtaining at least 20 year patent for minor reform reformulas or other uh of a drug without necessarily increasing the therapeutic case of the patent evergreening counter like Apu medicine, Apu uh chorne, we leave the electronics, computer or electrical. In the case of pharmaceutical form, you will be able to pharmaceutical company, the medicine one up they use a chemical product. Agar uh, chemical product in Thora Savi. If you change content, you can change the content. If the property is changed, it means it is uh, new. It is new. It means that you can get patent. Okay. It is very easy for the, uh, for the uh, pharmaceutical company. Ki, ki, uh, you get the patent only for 20 years. Like you make, uh, like you make uh, one uh, drug for the fever. Okay. Like paracetamol. Like uh, one company make paracetamol, Dolo. Dolo paracetamol for the fever. Okay. We see in the market, there are different drugs for the fever. They, not, they know any there is not any single only 
we have the paracetamol, the paracetamol for the fever. Different medicine and fever. Okay, so if any company make medicine for the fever, he got patent for the 20 years. After 20 years, any company can use that product for the fever. Okay, so that it can, uh, so that if it's a company ka monopoly, what, he can decide the price. But if different company produce the same product, it will bring down the price. And for a uh, developing country like India, where there are a lot, there are a lot of poor people, the important thing is that life saving product work come price for me. In US, it is not like that. So, a patent evergreening can happen that any pharmaceutical company is what What 20 years ago, patent was like in the case of fever, 20 years complete over. Now he will like some chemical product like X in that uh, uh, drug. Who can say that they will change some properties in X and they will uh, again claim that see, I have changed the product. Now I now I again want the 20 years patent for that. Why do they do So that no any other company can use that product. It allows pharmaceutical company to obtain or obtain monopoly protection for all drugs simply by making minor modifications of existing formulas of dosage or by identifying a new therapeutic use of for of for an existing medicine. So us medicine use of actually actually correct. Now change the some uh, some uh, minor change or he uh, brings some modification. Also use fever to reduce fever. Come correctly correct. It does not bring any therapeutic change and therefore they can't get patent. This patent evergreen ko rokne ke liye humne section three D la patent act mein so that no any foreign country or Indian company in the uh, uh, in the case of pharmaceutical they can get the monopoly or uh, monopoly of single medicine. It is in the US. Therefore the hospitals or medicine is very costly in the US. India it is very because we don't uh, we don't give the monopoly any uh, product or any, or any process to the any particular pharmaceutical company. So in the case of uh, uh, notice versus in of India, the Supreme Court made it crystal clear that in the case of medicine, the case it is only with therapeutic efficacy. And they state that all properties of drugs are not relevant. The property is directly related to the efficacy in case of medic medicine is its therapeutic. Like he used some product X. So this this uh, properties no sir. Now if the A properties here that bring the therapeutic efficacy means that that and that product can cure the fever. No. The company can use some modification that bring change in the second or third property, but it does not bring change in the eighth property. Means it can does not bring the uh, change in the property which can reduce the fever. It can bring uh, change in the property like any property, like it change the color, it can change the nail, it can change the taste. The Supreme Court said no. Our medicine, your chemical property, I call it the smell change from this. Its taste is very important. If you change the property which bring the therapeutic effects, so we have a new product. Like say that, if you if the first of fever, which is so. In 1999, then we will say that yes, it is a new product. But if you body pain, but you body pain, but you have body pain, change body pain, but you have body pain, but you have body pain, but you have body we will not say that that is a new uh, injunction and we will not take the pattern. Court in 30 rule that about 30 per case in bioavailability qualify as increase in theoretical efficacy under section 3D of patent act if evidence is provided for them. Supreme Court compared the efficacy of beta crystalline form of imatinamic uh, mesylate and with imatinamic mesylate with reference to its flow property, beta thermodynamic stability and lower hygroscopy and held that none of the properties contribute to increasing therapeutic efficacy according to section 3D of patent act and what is not provided any document that showed that the efficacy of beta is more as good efficacy of imatinib sealer. You see that ki to uh, second uh, product used kiya beta crystalline form of imatinib sealer kya change kiya tha? Slow property change kiya tha. Usne thermodynamic stability hi bula. Usne lower hygroscopicity kiya. But usne kobi waisa product change nahi kiya ki medicine set mein help kare. It does not bring any change in the therapeutic efficacy. It does not bring any change which bring the relief to the patient. So that we can't give patent to that product. So this is all some theory or this is all about the patent right uh, in the section of medicine. Uh, another section that is 3K. It is also very important. Section 3K deals with the computer program and algorithm. And what is that? In its true form, computer program software algorithm may not be patentable as such. However, technical comprehension technique may be patentable, subjected to patentability as such. What is computer program algorithm? If you simply write a program, computer program, and you think that, okay, this program is very unique, very, uh, it is new, it has not been used by anyone, and you apply for a patent for the computer program, can you get patent for it. No, you will not get patent for it. If you design any algorithm or any process, can you get the patent? No, you can't get it. Why? Then how can we get the patent? You have to show that that particular program or that particular algorithm work with that particular hardware. If you attach that computer program, attach that particular algorithm with, a, with an, an, any hardware and it brings some change in the hardware, then you can apply for the patent for that. But see, this is my computer program and it can be used in that place and it can bring some change. Then you can get patent for it, like you uh, write your computer program so that, uh, uh, like, uh, it brings some 
change mechanical property of car. Okay, the it is especially so it's a program. But if some uh, person write a simple program, apply for the patent here, he will not the uh, patent for a computer program. But if he uh, write a computer program and say that that particular program will work automatic out of the car, okay, that is that is that will be called as, as an invention, and he can get the patent for that computer. Program. So <clears throat> a simple algorithm and a simple computer program will not get in India. Okay, here we use the how the technical effect comprising technical advancement. It is important with a computer program. Then question is what are the different technical effect which we can see when we apply for the uh, patent for the computer program. So these are the technical effect which can be seen. It reduces the hard disk access time, bring more effective data compression technique, the user interface, it will bring better control of robotic arm, it will bring more economical use of memory as this technical we see then we can say oh, okay okay we yeah, we can give the uh, patent for that computer program or algorithm technical advancement contribute to the state of art in any field of technology technical advancement and advancement comes with technical effect but all technical effect may or may not be result in technical if there is technical advancement we see that there is technical effect but all technical effect will not be technical advanced these are a simple thing okay uh, till now we have discussed uh, about the patent now we will go into the copyright uh, in the college we see that we use the we use the photocopy of any book to read we simply go go to the uh, photocopy machine we photocopy the book and we start studying can the writer of the book or the publisher of the book sue that college sue that university or sue that person they see that or college or any person are using the photocopy of my book without my permission so i i want to remember can it possible is a famous case university of oxford and owes versus i'm sorry photocopy service a photo shop uh, present on the delhi school of economic dsc permission in uh, delhi north campus so of the uh, some of the professors at the that DLC have developed course uh, packet that include the pages from public or various and publishing. Ramaswari photography service was interested with duplicating and binding these pages and distributing them to students for 50 pesa is okay. So the uh, professor from that college had uh, used the, the books from different uh, publishing. They made a simple uh, they do they make a simple uh, one by using a different uh, international book and uh, that uh, and there is one uh, photography service and he, that uh, that uh, photography service will be photo copy book to different students of the college. In 2000, they were Oxford University Press, Cambridge University Press, and Taylor and Francis Group had, and other filed a copyright judgment law against Ramaswari photo business and the, in, Delhi, in the Delhi High Court for distributing copy for person of their publishing book without any appropriate license. Be a publisher, the Oxford University publisher and the Cambridge University publisher. They, uh, they, uh, that company, uh, that uh, uh, publisher had filed the copyright infringement uh, suit in the Delhi High Court against that photo that photocopy shop DS. In 2016, a two judge been set aside the previous order and allowed for this lawsuit to try to continue, saying that the reproduction of copyrighted book for educational purpose is not copyrighted. Okay. So Delhi High Court ordered that this is not the educational purpose. Okay. The it is sold very small price, like 50 pesa per piece. It is not being sold at 1000 rupees or rupees. It is not being sold in all all ranks since so at the camp college. It is it is being used for educational purpose, so it is not copyright in prison. Okay. If a particular ex professor from that college start using the uh, start writing a book by simply photocopying that uh, uh, photocopying the books from the international publisher then it can come under the uh, infringement of copyright but it is simply used for education purpose for the student so it is not the infringement so there are there are some exceptions to copyright copyright infringement under section 52 of the Com uh, copyright act 1950 what are the different exceptions to, to the copyright infringement first is if you are dealing with any work not being a computer program for the purpose of private or personal use including, including research criticism or review Result of that work or, or any other work, the report current events and current affair, including the reporting of a lecture delivering in public. We see that there, are, there are different current affair book in the uh, in the market, which uh, which has been used, uh, which uh, which copied from the different newspaper. That newspaper will not uh, file the copyright uh, infringement against publisher because it is for that purpose. Okay, if you have done something and some other person X copied at your uh, like like uh, in the see that on YouTube, there are different critics or reviewers of that movie. That director or that writer. The movie will not uh, will not uh, uh, file the copyright infringement against these critics. God also comes copyright you are doing uh, criticism or some doing review of any work. It will not uh, come under the uh, come under the, the fair nature of uh, dealing depends on following four factors: the purpose of use, the nature of work, the amount of work used, and the effect of use of the work on the origin. These are the the fair nature of dealing. The reproduction of any work by each other will in the course instruction as a part of question to be answered in an examination. In answer to the two such question, you see. Uh, in the uh, multiple choice term, there are four options, and there is one option okay that is very uh, that, that is uh, that is used from the different books. That 
try to will not uh, allow the infringement because it is being used for the in the precedence. So it will also not come under the infringement of copyright. Okay, by a teacher or pupil in the course of instruction in answer to this question, like there is any question you are adding an answer from uh, using the from different book that I will not come and find the infringement because simply as the the performance in the course of activities of an educational institution of a literary, dramatic, or musical stuff and obviously or of a cinematographic film or a sound recording, the audience is limited to such as the parents and guardian of student and person connected with the activities of the institute of the communication such as audience a cinematographic film or sound recording. College or school may have dance performance karte hai, music performance karte hai, kuch bhi karte hai. Wo bhi direct from Bollywood or Hollywood se poh uthate hai. We don't take the permission from a director or actor from that movie. We simply perform. It will not come the infringement of copyright. Kyunki ye jo kaam ye ye ek is hai, ek tool ka aur ye kaafi kam log hai dance film institution ka. Hum ka we are not public to earn money. Okay. You see that if any famous singer is performing on the stage, he only song, he only sing that song that will sung by him. Agar or sing performing any stage performance, he he will only sing that song that has been that has been sung by him. He will not sing the song of the other one. That will come under the uh, come under the infringement because it is being used on money. Okay, you understand that the reproduction of any work in a certified copy made or supplied in accordance with uh, any law for the time being forced. The reading or recit uh, recitation of in public of reasonable text from a published literary or dramatic work. These all things are the exception to copyright infringement. There is one famous uh, case also. This is the case of the <coughs> geographical indication, the Bengal Mesugula and the Odisha Mesugula. Okay, first the Bengal uh, Bengal West Bengal has filed for the ge geographical indication of the Bengal Mesugula. <laughs> he also got that right. After it, Odisha also has filed. No, the school, the origin of that, the origin of that Mesugula is from uh, Odisha. So Mesugula should be famous from Odisha, not from the Bengal. In November 2017, West Bengal State Food Processing and Horti Horticulture Development Corporation Limited got the GI register as a Bengal Bengal. Rasgulla. An objection to the GI registration was filed, citing that the origin of this famous suite was in the Jagannath Temple of Puri in Odisha. The GI registry notified that Odisha got the GI register as Odisha Rasgulla. The GI registry has not given regist uh, uh, registration to the term Rasgulla and Rasgulla. Okay, so we uh, uh, give two different names for the same. So, uh, we don't the geographical indications as the simple name. And the two are our names. The Bengal Rasgulla and the Rasgulla name. It has specifically uh, two words to the GI tag. One is Bengal and the other one is Odisha. Thereby, in that work, we should be anyone in that journey. We see that this Rasgulla is simply so different parts of the country. Okay, Orissa or Bengal come in Monopoly. If we go in the market, we said please give Rasgulla, or we said please give the Bengal, or we said please give the Bengal. Uh, so there are three different Rasgulla one is Bengal Rasgulla, one is Bengal Rasgulla. Okay, so Rasgulla is not getting a uh, GI tag. We get two GI tags one is Bengal Rasgulla, another one is Orissa. Okay, so till now we have discussed the different hmm, case study linked with the pet. Patent link with the copyright link with the GI. Okay, uh, these are the important links uh, online links. Like if you want to file the patent, uh, you can simply go to the IP India Government dot in and you can file the online. You can do the online filing. IPR resource. Uh, uh, there are different fees for the different file uh, different form for the patent. You uh, you can get that information from IP India dot com also. Uh, we have discussed that uh, we have different validity for the different copyright for a patent. We go twenty years for design. It is ten years and it can extend up. To five years for a trademark, it is for a lifetime rene renewable. Yes, uh, uh, initially it can give it is given for a 10 year, after that it can go for the indefinite renewable. GI tag it is also given to the uh, initially for 10 years, after that it can renew uh, indefinite copyright. It is given for the lifetime of the author plus 60 years. Okay, so we have different uh, time duration for a different cop uh, different intellectual property right. Who can apply for the intellectual property right except GI tag for the patent, for the design, for the copyright, for the semiconductor design circuit? Okay, or uh, for the trademark a company or a uh, or a person can file for a GI tag that particular place will file not a particular person these are some points that we should remember first we have to protect then we have to publish okay like if like you uh, we write poem yeah or we design some or we write a book what we do our tendency to talk about gana likhte hain ya song likhte hain poem likhte hain na invention hamare tendency ye ho ko kaun se wasi ye maine invention kiya hai dekho bilkul na try to famous but there 
is one the drawback there. Anyone, if you don't get patent, if you don't get intellectual right for that, your invention or your book or your, or your poem or your song, any other person can copy. They can go to government and they so invention of kia, book up in the gun up in the car, poem up in the car, up public with Chalega, up in the speaker, the koi ex person public with the copy Kalia, who government of India Chalega, play for the patent, government of India, okay, fill up case over the Lana Paraga. So, first point is that we have first year protect, then you have these rights are territorial in nature. Get also provided in India, you can get you uh, any other person from different country can copy your product. Okay, registration is done by the sovereign authority for any the government. The rights are for a limited period of time. You see, uh, see that the patent is for 20 years. They know any appeal. You have to need to file the individual suit and renewal to be paid for it. This is simple uh, basic training for the patent. For the more further training, there is one uh, uh, Rajiv Gandhi NIPM in Nagpur which gives the extensive training for the patent. Other special property rights. Uh, these are contact details, phone number, email, and website. So these are all the things that uh, we have discussed uh, about the different case study about the intellectual property rights. Hope the session was good. I will hand over the the Arnav sir and uh, thank you very much. Uh, so hopes have fitted from his talk on IPs as studies. So he discussed uh, the one of the earliest case study and also uh, the some of the recent uh, case of uh, Rasugulla. It was a kind of a between two states. There was a issue so, and also a, about the copyright cases of your foot. So. Uh, uh, I hope uh, these kind of case studies uh, help the participant uh, look into the issues which come in their daily research and if some kind of there they can then think of how how they can go forward and get and uh, so once again thank you very much uh, Nikhil ji for uh, your important talk and uh, any questions are there all those in the chat box um, any other questions uh, the, the party want hello hello uh, okay, sir. you are for public for a good audience that is not infringement yeah. If it is organized for commercial activity paid by you, then mm, sir, can you repeat the question? Yeah, any performance in public. Okay. Since there is one performer and he will take the IJ or farming, that will be okay. that will be okay. under infringement or not? Okay. Uh, uh, you uh, you say that if I if I am performing on the show and if I if I am getting money for yeah. the performance. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, it will also depend on the particular place, like in the education institute or some. Uh, places uh, like uh, there is limitation of audience. It, it will also matter how much audience are present. Okay, if there is large amount of audience are present, and if I am getting uh, commercial, then uh, then yes, it will come under the infringement. It also depends about, about the amount of audience. Uh, there is one um, question uh, request by Preeta for uh, details about PPB FRA. Preeta, I think uh, in this uh, uh, webinar series we are discussing more about the IPs of patent copyright. Trademarks. Uh, we definitely in future. Yeah, there is one question from uh, IVRI that I asked regarding uh, mobile applications and uh, what kind of is actually. Applicable. I think about AI. If AI is being used um, detecting the micro applications of varied kinds. Uh, mobile applications. Okay, can you repeat the question? Mobile applications are developed, and uh, generally I have noticed uh, many go for a copyright on it. Yes, yes. But uh, uh -huh. is that all we can get from a mobile app? or uh, it would uh, it. no no mm -hmm. mobile applications are not patentable because it, it is not linked with any hardware so we simply uh, see that we have different mobile applications for, for the shopping we have Flipkart we have Amazon we have Snapdeal these are the simple uh, uh, mobile applications we have some uh, uh, we have some uh, uh, like coding and it is also business model so if we uh, if it get patent so we have not different mobile applications for the simple world but yes it can go for the copyright for the user manual because different companies have different user manual so they can go for the uh, copyright but it is not patentable in India that mobile application brings some output some hardware uh, something in the hardware okay then it can go for the patent uh, yeah. I, I was, because mobile application uh, can be doing billion like uh, if there are applications like the ones that are used by Uber La, so, yes sir Amazon business model it's all a platform yeah. based business which yes. runs across all the countries a global market uh, yes any yeah. any any new invention? I have a copyright on. Yes, yes. Uh, we have the uh, section uh, which which limited the invention regarding the business model. If some invention in business, like uh, we see in the Amazon or Flipkart, anything, they are doing the business. These are 
but they do not come under under the invention so they do not come under the patent they will not get the patent in india but uh, there are other countries which allow uh, patenting that yes 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 a different country have different rule you can get patent for the simple computer computer programming in us but you can't get the patent in india there is one more question from uh, tamil selvan uh, in please inform whether predictive statistical models are patentable predictive statistical model so for uh, predictable statistical model so first of all yeah, the inventor has to prove that it is not a mathematical model second he has to prove that it is not only simply content algorithm uh, third he has to prove that it brings some changes in the uh, hardware structure if these uh, these three things have been proved and also it, it brings some industrial industry uh, application then all, yes they can get a patent but i think the, uh, that that statistical uh, model can come under the mathematical model so they have to prove it does not come under the mathematical model if they have proved this three to four things they can get the patent if a patent status is abandoned is there any mean to reinitiate the process from there no it will not be started because that patent application become the prior art so when you file the application with the same uh, uh, title same invention and if you go for the examination you will get that application as a prior art so that application will become the prior art of that invention so it will not be possible to get patent for that uh, uh, for that application